Okay, boys and girls, so this is going to be your reading practice page for this week. It is titled Cold Harvest, 1880, and then the page number is 37, so remember it's page 37. So read the selection and choose the best answer to each question. You are to read the selection, pause the video for right now so you can read the selection on your own, and then start it so that we can go over the questions and answers. Number one, which statement best describes the narration of this story? A, the story is narrated in third person by Evie, who lives on a farm with her sister and parents. B, the story is narrated in third person by Christina, who lives on a farm with her sister and parents. C, the story is narrated in third person by the mother who knows what the children are doing and thinking while working on the farm. D, the story is observed by a narrator who is not part of the action in the story. The narrator's thoughts in paragraph one emphasize that F, the narrator leads a comfortable, easy life. G, the whole family is affected by the approaching snow. H, the parents are responsible for tending the garden and food cellar. J, the cabin is warm and a spacious place to live. Three, which best describes the relationship between Christina and Evie? A, they're caring and loving with each other. B, they often misunderstand each other. C, they fight against a common foe together. D, they work to, toward a common goal together. Number four, read this sentence from the paragraph three. I listened for the sound of concern in her voice, but as I left, I heard her singing softly as she stirred apples that cooked on the wood stove. The reader can infer from this sentence that the mother F is trying to hide something from the family. G is worried about the oncoming snowstorm. H feels well prepared for the winter ahead. J needs more help than she is willing to admit. And your last question, number five. How would the story be different if it were told from the father's point of view? A. It would include descriptions of other tasks completed that day. B. It would explain whether the mother was worried about winter. C. It would reveal the thoughts and feelings of Evie. Or D. It would tell what happened after the snow started to fall. You would answer all the five questions only. Ending on page 39.